All right, what's going on everybody? Junior with SOT Metalwork, finally back with you and another video. Hope everybody has been doing fantastic. We've taken a little hiatus. Been extremely busy here in the shop. Got some big things going on. Can't talk about them quite yet, but we are uh, here again, cutting out another sign. I believe this one is Rain Man's Beagles, and this sign turns out fantastic. A uh, really cool metallic color on it. So yeah, back in the saddle again with some videos. Hopefully you guys ain't abandoned us and uh, and run off by any stretch of the imagination. But uh, looking forward to get back and posting videos on a regular. Can't thank you guys enough for hanging in there with us while we've uh, been covered up. But it's a good thing these times and days. So all right, let's get into it and see what happens. All right, ladies and gents, there you go. Right out the gate, Rain Man's Beagles. Looking pretty good. Got the dog chasing the rabbit there. He's into some trees. Got them covered down for him. So, yeah, the only thing I forgot is we probably going to drill a couple holes. One here, uh, one here, one on this side, and probably one down here at the bottom. Get those jokers centered up. Get him some mountain holes in there. That's the only thing I forgot. Sometimes on the old shop saber, the operator forgets to do a thing or two, but I think the sign turned out fairly well. But yeah, fresh off the table. Got to get the wire wheel on it, get her cleaned up. Uh, you can see the back side here. She's still a little bit warm, not too bad, but uh, tips are doing fairly good. Not too much slag. There's a little bit in there. I, uh, I want to say we cut out... I don't know, it's been about a dozen signs probably, right? 10, 10, 12 signs right there at it uh, with those consumables. So they're still holding up fairly well. Uh, it all depends on the thickness of metal, the signs you're cutting and stuff like that, how well those consumables are gonna hold up. So, all right, let's get this joker cleaned up. We'll get back at you guys. We'll get a little primer on it. Um, you know, if we run into any issues we found or anything like that, we'll let you know. All right, you guys hang in there. Alright ladies and gents, out here uh, etching off the Rain Man Beagle sign. You guys know what that means. Could be a little metallic involved in this stuff. But uh, yeah, got the magical solution out. We're getting after it. No, I won't tell you what the magical solution is. You'll have to uh, do a little research on your own. Can't give all the tricks away. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Out here getting after it. We'll let that set a little bit more. She just about got all the mill scale off of it. Not, uh, 
this piece of steel's etched fairly fairly good so yeah let me get a, all the shadows in the, in the frame there but there she is pretty much etched off got a little bit more here that uh that magical juice will uh fairy dust will will uh, etch that stuff right off but all right, we'll let this sit a little while. We'll be back inside getting some uh, paint on this joker. Or maybe, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll get some paint on it. Uh, and let you guys take a look at that. See what color we're gonna paint it. All right, ladies and gents, back on the Rain Man's Beagles. So we've got all our designs in our metal. Got her all etched down. I got her all etched down. Got her in here, got cleaned up. Got all the designs on it. Now we're gonna spray a little color on it. What color you guys reckon it's gonna be? Probably gonna, probably not gonna guess this one, but we're gonna go with metallic green. That's right. Metallic green comes out pretty, pretty awesome. Good old metallic green, can't beat it. All right, a couple minutes later, we are back after it got interrupted there. The mailman dropped some good stuff off, so the wife was happy, I was not. But it's all part of the fun. Got to keep the wife happy, that way, you know, things are squared away. But uh, no presents from the mailman for SOT, but Maybe, maybe Monday, maybe Monday. It's a uh, Saturday when you're seeing this. So, hopefully it's not too hectic of a day today. Last weekend, had a uh, junkyard going on. Weekend before that, we had some other YouTuber stuff going. And I am sorry, because I have not been posting a tremendous amount of videos, but guys, it's all I can do to keep up right now. Hopefully we're going to get caught up in the next little bit here. So, all right, we're getting these edges. You guys see uh, that edge right there. It did not get done up. That edge there. Important, important, important. All right. Green is looking mighty fantastic. Let's go over one more good time with a good coat of green. Make sure everything is good and covered. This is, uh, I go through cover the edges and then I come back and feather everything in. Try to get all the, uh, all the colors the same. Uh, with this metallic, it's not too terrible, but you will have light and dark spots in it a little bit. You want to go back and try to uh, fade all that stuff together, not have one little light spot, one dark spot. So, getting awful good. I tell you what, I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat that. Beat that with a stick right there. Wow. That joker is sharp. All right, let's let this dry up, see how everything looks. We'll get some clear on it. Should be good to go. All right, ladies and gents, how's it going? Back in here in the photo booth, got the Rain Man's Beagle sign in here. And I want to tell you what, this sign here turned out fantastic. I mean, would you look at the green on that? That metallic is just shining. It, it is absolutely crazy, but Big shout out to the gentleman for his order. Can't thank him enough. It, uh, it's been pretty cool to do this one. I like how the colors come out on it, or the color, I should say. Uh, fairly, fairly simple, easy one to do. It was a fairly easy draw up. Uh, he didn't ask for a tremendous lot, uh, and we kind of incorporated everything he needed. He sent us a sign he kind of liked, uh, a picture of a sign he kind of liked, and said, hey, incorporate something similar to this, and we tried to do our best, change it up a little bit so he didn't have one just like somebody else had and incorporated everything he needed to uh, to get in there so 
hopefully he's satisfied with this when he gets it. I uh, hope this one does him proud. I think this is a pretty cool one. So if you need a rabbit and a, a, a beagle chasing a rabbit in one of your signs or something like that, give us a look, SOTMetalworks.com. You can uh, get in contact with us over there. Shoot us an email, shootersoptiontargets at gmail.com. We'll answer any questions you got, get you something drawn up, whatever we need to do. Check us on Instagram, check us on Facebook, uh, SOT Metalworks, all the way around. We try to hit all the social media platforms we can. But yeah, I want to thank you guys for hanging out with us. This has been a fairly good one to do. Not uh, not no uh, big catast catastrophes whatsoever that I can think of, but uh, yeah. All right, guys, we're going to check on out of here. Hopefully, you guys are being safe. And as always, you fine folks remember, work smarter, not harder. We'll catch y'all later.